GLP-1. There are studies that have shown that um, the GLP-1 can help lower the risk of heart disease and stroke um, because it, you know, you have you have better blood pressure and um, what else is it? And lower lipids. Yeah, no, I mean, I think th this class of drugs has been phenomenal in one aspect. I mean, if you look at the, what was it, the SAG Awards or what, 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 there was a recent award show and all the actresses now look like they weigh about 95 pounds and that almost the looks- The Golden Globes yeah, were like yeah, that. <laughs> that looks unhealthy to me. But basically, what do those drugs do? They suppress appetite and ultimately, they're gonna get your blood sugars down, they're gonna get your uh, uh, blood sugars, blood pressure, uh, they're gonna get your lipids down, they're gonna get your weight down. And, and because of those end effects, they're gonna be good for you cardiovascularly. And so we are starting to see, and they will work their way into the medical guidelines uh, of you know, how do you help manage people's heart failure. So I think they are, they are good drugs. I think their time will tell like what the long-term is on them. I mean, I, I have certainly used it to give myself a little boost to, to lose weight. And after a little while, didn't really like it, but I wasn't really planning on staying on it forever. I wanted to adjust and do a little bit more diet exercise, but it gets you over the hump of trying to lose a little weight. Most people, when they stop taking them, just gain the weight back, unless they've made major lifestyle changes. So the best way to keep yourself healthy is always gonna be diet and exercise. And by diet, I mean any diet that keeps you from gaining weight. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't have to be keto. It doesn't have to be intermittent fasting. It doesn't have to be vegan or vegetarian. But I also am a big believer in, you know, people should live their lives. You know, yeah. I think where life is supposed to be lived yeah. and enjoyed. And, and, and so a life of deprivation isn't necessarily what I would <laughs> advocate for either.